Lord God of his land. He has paid a ransom for us. In the house of David, he has raised up salvation for us all. will remember his covenants, the oath he has given to us. He will protect us from enemies, from the hands of those who wait. He will show his mercy to us, mercy that shines bright out. child will be called the prophet of the most high God. You will go before the Lord to prepare the way for him. He will show his mercy to us, mercy that shines bright as the sun. Shines bright as the sun, and in the shadow of death, you guide us on to peace. Praise to the Lord God of Israel, He has paid a ransom for us. House of David, he has raised up salvation for us all. So we just had the opportunity to hear a newer song. This one's called Zechariah's Song. And it's really a new interpretation on the canticle of Zechariah which is that beautiful song, that beautiful poem, that, that beautiful prayer, we could say, that was prayed by Zechariah himself. You know, on, on behalf of John the Baptist, we can say, you know, praying for, praying to our Lord, you know, on behalf of his new son, the son that was proclaimed to him by the angel Gabriel, the son that was meant to proclaim the Lord himself. And these beautiful words that we get from Zechariah, just they lead the way to Christ. Just as we've been asked, asked to do throughout this Advent season to prepare for the coming of Jesus, well, that was exactly what John the Baptist was all about. And that's exactly what Zechariah was, was singing, proclaiming to his son to be able to do that. And we hear that today as we hear, You, my child, will be called a prophet of the Most High God. You will go before the Lord to prepare the way for him. In the season of preparation, John the Baptist is this beautiful, wonderful example of what that means to prepare. And even he was prepared for by his father, Zechariah, and by this beautiful canticle that we get. And so my brothers and sisters, as we hear this story of Zechariah and Elizabeth and John the Baptist, as we hear this kind of song, I hope that it might bolster us as we get closer and closer, so close to the Christmas season, to only prepare all the more, to get ready for Christ to come into our world and into our own hearts, and really, so that we might be prophets in our own time, getting everyone ready for Jesus and his coming on Christmas.